chief reason I brought it forward was two years ago, uh, folks came out of the community and told me, so we got to start doing something about this issue. So I, I started talking to Mr. Starman and the attorney, Mr. Duvernay, and um, we did, we, they decided that we needed to wait. So I waited two years. We kept talking to him off and on, talking to the police chief off and on. And then uh, now people are really starting to get, to get back on me and, and said we need to do something. And especially through last summer, you won't believe the number of messages, phone messages and email messages I got from people in the city uh, with, uh, with problems with the smell. And then also the commercial grows that are in the city. There are some pretty sizable commercial grows that are growing right in the city. And now that the county is is uh, is eliminated outdoor growth uh, in the unincorporated areas, we're gonna it's gonna come into town. We're we're gonna have a problem. And uh, the thing that really bothers me the most is is people that listen to the uh, to the tape of uh, the video of the of the meeting tonight. Uh, Council Member MacArthur just doesn't want to have to listen to those people and go through that all over again. Well, heck, I'm gonna I'll, I'll stand right there, and if it takes 12 hours to go through it, I'll do it over again. I mean, it's an issue that has to be effectively taken care of, and right now the Reading City Council is not taking What's care of What's going to have to happen is that people are going to have to come in here and they're going to have to start telling the council what to do and uh, enforcing them to move forward, or maybe even have a, 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 a ballot initiative and, uh, and uh, put it on the ballot to move forward.